Welcome to another Southeastern IT tutorial. Today I will show you how to reset your single sign-on password or commonly referred to as SSO password. If you don't know what SSO is, there's a link in the description below that will help. This password is used here at Southeastern to access the following systems. MySC, Email, Blackboard, StarRes, Computer Logon, LinkedIn Learning, Colleague Self-Service, Web Advisor, Library Proxy Server, and the list continues to grow. For the purposes of this video, we have a student by the name of Bolt the Bison that will be helping through the password reset process. Here are the steps to reset your Southeastern single sign-on password. Step 1. Open up a web browser and navigate to passwordreset.se.edu. Step 2. Enter your Southeastern email address and enter the characters shown in the CAPTCHA. If you don't know your Southeastern email address, please refer back to your acceptance package or your initial email from Southeastern. Click Next. Step 3. Here you are presented with two options. I forgot my password. Use this option if you're not sure what your password is. I know my password but still can't sign in. Use this option if you're certain you know your password but still can't sign in and I've selected I forgot my password to help get Bolt's password reset. Step 4. Here are the three possible options you have available to reset your password. Email my alternate email. This option will email the personal email address that Southeastern has on file for you. Text my mobile phone and call my mobile phone. These options will text or call the mobile number on file. I've chosen to use the alternate email option for Bolt. Here you can see part of the personal email address to help confirm which personal email address is listed on your account. Click email to send the alternate email a verification code. Step 5. Enter the verification code that is sent to your alternate email address or mobile number. Click Next and enter a new password. Your new password needs to meet the following requirements. A minimum of 8 characters in length. It must contain 3 out of these 4 character types. Capital letter, lowercase, number, and special character. Click Finish. And that's it. Now you can sign into any Southeastern SSO authentication page. This concludes this tutorial, and as always, thanks for watching.